Dash Dabrowski here, and I am pumped for the January 6th committee hearings. Jamie Raskin just revealed that they have evidence to suggest more than incitement, but rather a conspiracy by Donald Trump and the Republicans to launch a deadly coup on the United States government. Watch. You use that word conspiracy. Uh, your colleague, Representative Liz Cheney, she used that over the weekend in a separate interview. So did a federal judge, David Carter. Uh, he said that it was more likely than not that Donald Trump was part of a conspiracy to overturn the elections. So is that what the hearing is going to lay out? Is that what the committee has found? Um, yes, the committee has found evidence of concerted planning uh, and premeditated activity. Uh, the idea that all of this was just uh, a rowdy demonstration that um, spontaneously got a little bit out of control is absurd. Uh, you don't almost knock over the US government by accident. Um, so uh, we're gonna lay out uh, all of the evidence we have found. House Resolution 503 charges us with uh, defining what happened on January 6th, explaining the causes of what happened, and then uh, ultimately laying out uh, recommendations that would allow us to fortify ourselves against coups and insurrections moving forward. And is Donald Trump the center of this conspiracy? Are you able to connect those dots? Well, um, I, you know, people are going to have to make judgments themselves about the relative role that different people played. But uh, I think that uh, Donald Trump and the White House were at the center of these events. That's the only way really of making sense of them all. Uh, of course, the House and the Senate in bicameral and bipartisan fashion have already determined that um, the former president, Donald Trump, incited an insurrection uh, by majority votes in the House and the Senate, although uh, Donald Trump wasn't convicted by the requisite two thirds majority, but uh, commanding majorities found that uh, he had in fact incited this insurrection. But uh, the, uh, the select committee has found evidence about a lot more than incitement here. And we are gonna be laying out the evidence about all of the actors uh, who were pivotal to what took place on January 6th. Now do you understand why Fox News, Donald Trump, and the Republicans don't want you to watch these hearings? Because it's gonna link all of them to the deadly insurrection. I cannot wait for Jamie Raskin and the Democrats to blow the roof off the house in the hearings this Thursday and send the GOP criminals where they belong to the big house.